In today's video, this will be part two of the Midnight Solar Incorporated Kit charge controller. This is the uh, 30 amp charge controller made by Midnight Solar with the MPPT tracking system. Very powerful uh, device. Small at the front. You see a load. We got a um, Right here, we see a 30 amp, we got a 40 amp on the PV inputs. And if you look down here, another 40 amp going to the batteries. So this is the display settings, button soft keys. And we're going to do what I'm gonna do here. We're gonna get inside or the guts. We're gonna see inside the midnight. Uh, class sorry midnight kid and uh take a look and see how everything set up in there for this uh, little guy stay tuned subscribe and share on the back of this device you see we have only one screw which is not like the um, normal for any other charge controllers they might probably have one um three or four so we're gonna go take this apart and so that you guys can see we're just gonna do a quick glance and point out some of the few things uh, in here voila so look at the metal It's built like a, a cast iron and uh, it's just really cool it's it's a metal and uh, just to dissipate the heat of this thing since it doesn't have no fans on it so guys, this is um, how this thing is set up here. So let's take a look and see inside of this guy, how this guy is set up. And to be honest with you, I think this thing is really uh, a killer. It's built really well. So if you look at this guy, Sorry for the shake. Um, you will see here is for the Wispang Junior connection. If I can set this camera straight, you guys can be able to see properly. So you can see it's gonna say Wispang Junior W right there WB right there WBJR so you can see the inputs here it says uh, PV and wind you can use this for wind you can use the load clipper which um, you can buy is a separate uh, uh, addition if you want that the clipper load and here is the battery input okay so here is the communication ports that you guys can see which is kind of a little bit different to the big ones the big ones is gonna be the uh, the temperature sensor which is here and it's gonna be the communication for the um, um, the display panel okay but here you can see it says the master and slave. So I think there you can able to do the, um, you can able to do um, the follow me mode, I suppose. So correct me if I'm wrong. What I say is supposed to do follow me mode thing, which has the master and the slave. And down here is for the, uh, um, software a usb mini usb for updating the firmware okay look at this capacitor in here just take a look how uh, this thing for you guys i like to uh monkey around and see how things are set up I'm trying to get this camera steady and um, you can take a look how this thing is built 
got this stuff here just like when you have a knobs to regulate something I don't know much about them but it has two big uh, capacitor medium size I think it's an inductor mode thing this here because since it doesn't have any fan I think that's how you dissipate the heat so this is a nice block for terminals and everything looks pretty good well guys I'm not trying to tear up this thing and trying to show exactly how it's built because I'm not technically into the board part of it but I just want to give you a quick glance inside the uh, the kit and see how everything is set up and I hope you appreciate that and um, thanks for watching and you've seen the terminals how they set up and uh, where the West Bank Junior goes and um, we go from there okay all right let's put it into action the next time I'm gonna show you how this thing works um, if you haven't had, had one of these or some of you guys already have one and you know exactly how it works but it's nice always to see someone um, monkeying around with their own devices stay tuned for this love you guys all live from Minnesota another video part two of the midnight the kid right there see underneath says the kid mppt 30 amp charge controller made by midnight solar bye for now love you guys all stay tuned for more videos if you haven't been a subscriber yet please go subscribe and push the notification bell and um, so you can get notification anytime i upload videos okay all right giving you a quick look sorry for the shaky camera bye